What's up everybody? It's Laura, that RV girl, and I am in the 2025 Open Range Roamer Light Duty 244 RLS. And this short and sweet little beauty is my favorite small fifth wheel to date. So let's not waste any time. Let's get to it. All right, starting on the outside, let's take a look at that Lippert Rhino pin box up in the front. We've got our strong arm stabilizers. Now, first on the camp side, we've got the one side opening to our big pass-through storage here, and then we've got our propane. Now, this one comes equipped with three propane bottles. So we've got two on the camp side here on the tray, and then you'll see the other one just over on the driver's side. We've got a nice, fully finished basement storage here with lighting. We've got our Lippert solid step stair. Move our way to the back. You may have noticed we do have automatic leveling on this one. We've got an accessory hitch here in the back. We are also prepped for the on-the-go ladder by Lippert. So you'll notice that backing right up there. You just need to get the ladder extension piece that will hook right on. And then coming over here, you'll see we do have an on-demand water heater and your convenience station here located on the other side of your full pass. Here are your auto level controls. And there's that third propane bottle. All right, let's get cozy inside, shall we? Now we've entered into the main living space. Now this fifth wheel is only 28 foot four overall and we're just under 7,700 pounds dry weight. But you look at everything that you get. We have these full theater seats here. We've got this great sleeper sofa in the back. So we have additional sleeping if need. And then And then we've got this entertainment system here with our smart TV and check out the storage below. Tons of storage. Now you may have seen when we walked in here, this is a Four Seasons protected unit. So they are insulated windows all around us. And I mean, look at this bar top seating. Oh, I can just picture breakfast there in the mornings. I love this nice countertop here. Now in the theater seats, we do have cup holders with the little TV trays that you can swap in or out if you would like. And if you don't want to use those, then no problem. You've still got this little armrest here with your cup holders and your charging station. And now what I really love about this floor plan is how they put the oven and the stove right up here in this kind of coffee bar, generally coffee bar type of area. Now you still have space to do that if you want to put some kitchen appliances as we've got our outlets and we've got lighting under here as well. But just such a neat design with what they've done here, giving us the microwave, all of the cabinetry around. And now let's take a look further at our stove. It's going to be a three burner stove. And then right below, you'll see we've got a great size oven. And look at this pots and pans drawer. And then we've got another set of outlets on this side and another light. Now we've got a 12 volt refrigerator. So top, bottom freezer. And then just below, we've got another drawer, just all the storage they could possibly give you, they've given you. Over here in the island, speaking of storage, 
at this little utensil drawer we've got here. Now we do have a nice deep stainless steel sink underneath that's separated by your removable cutting board and drying rack. Plenty of space here and then we've got this nice matte black finish on our faucet. And let's just look a little more at the storage here. We've got the hidden trash bin. And then another great little drawer here for utensils. And then even more storage space to top off the kitchen you've got here in your pantry. Plenty of space. Now next to the sofa we do have USB charging ports and an outlet and you're gonna find that on both sides and then just huge window in the back and the space is just so cozy now yes it's a smaller lightweight fifth wheel we're under 10,000 pounds fully loaded we're 9,500 pounds fully loaded for those of us here in BC, you don't need a heavy towing endorsement and we are half ton compatible with a hitch weight of 1330. So that is a dry hitch weight of 1,330 pounds. This is actually like, I'm just gonna call it, this has gotta be my favorite short, lightweight fifth wheel design ever. Yeah, just absolutely love this. All right, we're gonna make our way up into the bathroom. All right, so they've given you this nice, deep, kind of two-doored medicine cabinet here. And then down below on our sink vanity area, they've given you this full wood finish top on the countertop that's gonna carry through into the bedside tables. We've got our outlets here. These are gonna be your controls for your fan and your lights. We've got a register here on the floor in the bathroom, give you some nice heat, keep you cozy. And then here into the shower, we do have a skylight for added headroom and then our shower head on a wand. A towel rack here, and then we've got another little one on the back of the door there. And then we're just gonna swoop around and take a look at some storage underneath the sink. And there you have it, that's your bathroom. Now let's make our way into the bedroom. Now this is where that faux wood top has carried through to our bedside tables. Oh, let's get some light, shall we? Okay, so on both sides, we've got this faux wood tabletop for our bedside tables. We've got drawers on both sides. And then we've got an outlet as well as the USB little charging port there. Now let's take a look on the other side. So same thing on the other side, everybody gets their own nightstand which you don't always see. And in the smaller fixed wheels, it's so nice to see even the addition of the drawers. We've got more storage separated by four doors. So you can easily access all points. All right, we've got a ducted AC unit up here. And then along the back, we've got this wardrobe here with two doors, plenty of hanging space, and then these nice deep drawers below. Now you'll also notice we've got a backed area for a TV with all your outlets up above. Let me show you this wardrobe area a little bit better. All right, so here we go. We're just gonna open that right up. Plenty of hanging space. Really deep drawers. And then of course, soft closed cabinet doors. We've also got our window here. We've got windows on either side. So campsite and over here as well on the driver's side. And they're both gonna have their own little shade that you can draw. And they will both open so that we can have a very nice cross breeze up here. Now, a really cool thing to note is underneath this bed, we are completely open. So instead of having to open up and reach in like we generally see with our beds, you've got all this open area for rolling totes and anything else you might need to store. All right, now this about wraps up this short and sweet fifth wheel. Let's head back down into the main living area for a wrap up.
All right, thank you all for joining me on this tour of the Open Range Roamer Light Duty 244 RLS. I'll see you guys in the next one.